Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're a first time watcher, glad to have you here. If you're a returning favorite, welcome back. So today is a video that I've been wanting to do for a while. Um, I only had one tidbit of information um, about Yankee Candle Halloween for 2021. And then today, I don't, a bunch of information kind of dropped on their website. Um, but you have to like, you have to like search for it, right? It's just, it's just not there. There's a whole web page dedicated to Halloween. And so piecing things together from what I have, what I have in my possession, what I, what I know, and a couple of the fragrances that I've seen are coming back, confirmed are coming back. You know, let's just talk Yankee Candle Halloween, guys. It's, um, looks like they're going to be having the party again, right? It is August 28th, so we're like 25 days away, um, 25, 26 days away from the big launch of Halloween. And... They are playing, I think, catch up with COVID and, and all this other stuff here. So, um, we'll see. A lot of shipping delays. So, uh, yeah, let's get into it there. So, here is the coupon um, that they're advertising here. We'll get into this in a second right there. So, it looks like the theme this year is this uh, Halloween Phantasmagoria, which... I looked it up, Phantasmagoria. It's like a theater thing from the 1800s, 1900s, a uh, terror theater. Um, I don't know. On the back here, we do have some of the, and I have some pictures I'm going to post up here as I'm talking throughout. Um, so here we have the uh, some of the accessories this year, uh, minus the Boney Bunch. I'll talk about Boney Bunch in a second here. Um, but we see we do have Witch's Brew coming back. Okay. Over here we have a skull. And in, it looks like he has a top hat. And we have a rose through his teeth, okay? This one here is, is a uh, taper holder. And that is a skeleton hand with a black rose, okay? And over here we have a votive holder right there. Skeleton hand with a red rose holding holding the, uh, the stem there. And over here it looks like we have another votive holder right there. Okay. that will be better pictures posted on my Instagram too as well. Um, and that's like holding like a, like a cauldron type deal. So there we have, um, oh, and also on the uh, witch's uh, brew right there, there is an Illumilid. And the Illumilid up close looks like it is, a, it's those black, a black rose, red rose, black rose, red rose, so on and so forth. Um, I don't see any green in there, but there might be, but I do see the red in there as well. Um, so those are some of the accessories for this year. And so I'll read what this says here. Uh, visit your local Yankee, vo visit your local store. Now I know a lot of stores have closed in the past year or two, so that's very difficult for a lot of folks. Um, not, not good. Um, revel in the wondrous new Phantasmagoria collection. Enjoy great giveaways and frightfully fun trivia. So on August 28th, and this is what I don't know if it's going to be online or only in store, um, $15 large Halloween candle. So there's five to choose from, which is brew being one of them. And, um, this is the new fragrance right here. Okay. We'll talk about that in a second. Um, so... There are five to choose from. Now, I'm going to put a picture up here um, of Yankee released four of the fragrances. So, Witch's Brew being one of them. So, this is Witch's Brew. These are old pours, by the way. Uh, Witch's Brew being one of them. Same label. Same label. We'll talk about that in a second. Um, Haunted Hayride being the other. Okay. The third one they did was Mystic Moon. Okay. And then the fourth one they posted is this mystery fragrance here. So if you take a look at the uh, at the mystery fragrance, okay, it's a yellow wax, and you can see it's kind of blurred, but this, if you put like this in the label, this is the label, okay? Don't get too excited over it because the scent name, I know it hasn't been announced yet here, but the set name is Spider Cider. So don't get too excited. There's something creepy or spooky or haunted or anything. It's Spider Cider. Um, I think he has an apple cider fragrance already. I don't know the set notes of this. I just, I do know it's Spider Cider. That's what I was alluding to in one of my previous videos of what I knew. <laughs> so Spider Cider. 
is the fragrance name. Uh, and it's a yellow, yellow wax candle there. So, you know, um, and then the fourth, the fifth candle, the fifth candle that is not pictured on there that they allude to in this thing where it says choose from five Halloween fragrances. My conclusion is it's Jack-O-Lantern. Okay. This was a release from last year. So Jack-O-Lantern and Mystic Moon are from last year. Now, the reason why I say it's Jack-O-Lantern is because I have seen pictures of Jack-O-Lantern with the brand new 2021 bottom label. Um, I've also seen Black Magic with the 2021 bottom label. However, Black Magic has been poured for the past two or three years exclusively for the outlets. So I don't think Black Magic is coming back into the main retail lineup. I could be wrong. It's a great fragrance. It's probably their last great fragrance that they did. No, it's not. I wonder how that was. So those are the five candles that I think we're going to see. Um, well, four we know are confirmed. And I think Jacqueline is going to be the fifth. So... I know a lot of folks want Haunted Hollow to return. Unfortunately, Haunted Hollow is retired. It's done. They removed the skew. They got rid of all the inventory that they had of it. Um, as far as I know, it is not coming back. Haunted Hollow, unfortunately, is one of my favorites, um, is not coming back. So the other... Um, let's talk about the set notes again, and we'll get to Bony Bunch, and we'll get to rumors of one thing that I think a lot of folks might like if it does happen so which is brew we know it's patchouli basically woodsy notes sweet notes clove cinnamon yada, yada, yada. it's classic um this is a 2018 pour i know i think 2018 and 2000 was it 2018 or 2019 was essentially unscented um i'm glad we're seeing this again this year hopefully they fixed it um, I don't believe we're getting any of these in Signature. I haven't seen anything that would lead me to believe that we are. Um, but I haven't seen anything to lead me that we aren't. So, uh, my guess is because it's Halloween and such a limited time frame, we're not going to see Signature releases of these Halloween fragrances. Which is kind of a bummer. Um, especially since they've been performing so well. But I don't think we're there yet. At least not this year. Um, Haunted Hayride. This candle came out in 2019. Um, it's been back, it was locked back last year. It's a funky fragrance. Um, it's woody scent with purifying charcoal, warm spices, and black pepper and nutmeg. This scent is really weird. Um, I, I don't think these five candles, these four candles are a strong Halloween lineup when you compare it to like Kringle, uh, especially when you compare it to Kringle. Um, but, so Haunted Hayride is coming back. The large label is gorgeous. Let's talk about labels. So, I know I'm going to have different tangents here. If... Fall collection and Christmas collection can get special labels, you know, with special larger labels and special fancy designs on it. Why can't Halloween? Why are the Halloween candles so bland? They used to do great labels for Halloween. They used to have the um, <sighs> iridescent, you know, that sparkle stuff to it. They used to have all that. They used to have things where you could turn it one way, it looked like this, turn it that way, it looked like that. Not anymore. So that's kind of a bummer. Um, so you, you can make it Halloween look so special and everything. Anyhow, and here's Mystic Moon. I like this one. It probably is one of their better scents over the past few years. Um, but it's because it's a floral, earthy. It's really a fruity vibe to it there. The, the official notes on this one is apple berry and violet leaf. Um, and then it's uh, Kleisman, Jasmine, and White Peach. And then the base note is Amber, Patchouli, and Vanilla. Um, hmm. You know, it's not the best. Um, and then the other candle here is Jack Lantern. This is, um, basic pumpkin spice. It's nothing special. Um, I know it was very, very popular last year when it came out. It was actually called something else over in the UK. I think it was called, um... Uh, pumpkin patch i think over in the uk or something like that um unfortunately i don't believe the uk and europe you guys are getting any halloween this year at all um i think that just got scrapped again covid is really messing up a lot of things on here so all right um yeah so on the yankee kind of website here again there's pictures and whatnot post them up here it just says um brew, brew up the best halloween yet with new and returning fragrances, enjoy a phantasmagory of 
sumptuous scents to tantalize the senses. And again, they have the picture of the new mystery candle, which is spider cider, guys. Um, spider cider, there, there have been, um, there's an old candle called Cider Web that's been in the outlets for the past few years. It's been in TJ Maxx, Home Goods, Marshalls, all those stores. I don't know if it's the same fragrance. Um, Cider Web has been around for a long, long time, uh, at least 10 years or so. Um, yeah, so, so Bony Bunch. I think that, that talks about that. Oh, so the one rumor that I have heard for an accessory again, I don't know if Bony Friends are coming back. Um, haven't seen anything or not. But um, in the picture of the Phantasmagoria, which is really neat. I'm all over the place, guys. Sorry, this, just want to get this out. Because um, we're just it's three weeks away. and We don't have much information. I mean, Yankees being very, Yankees either being very tight-lipped about this year or because of production delays and whatnot, they don't know what they're going to be releasing because they don't know if they're going to have the inventory in stock, um, which is where my Bony Bunch thing is into. Uh, Bony Bunch, it's it's coming. I don't know how much, but um, it's coming. It may be very limited. It's supposed to be... Uh, uh, I don't know if it's supposed to be online or in store. I don't know what. It says, new Bony Bunch coming soon. And they recycled a theme from only two years ago, which is very boring. Um, though I think I'm going to like it, but I just don't like that they just recycled it and we just did it two years ago. And okay, so it says the Bony Bunch is back and this year they brought a haunted carnival along for spooky chills and thrills. We just did that. We had the circus tent. We had um, the ringmaster. We had the guy going out of a, a cannon. We had all this stuff. Um, and the, so the picture that they show here is um, uh, a Mr. Boney and Mrs. Boney sharing an ice cream cone or a thing of cotton candy with a spider on it, sitting on a bench, it looks like, sitting on a bench. So it's probably like a tea light holder or a votive holder there. So again, don't know what Boney Bunch is going to be available, how many, price points, probably going to be expensive again. Um, yeah, they, uh, I don't think they know what they're going to have in stock. Maybe that's why they're not advertising it so crazy. You know, so the theme is Haunted Carnival, it appears. Um, okay. And the last tidbit of information that I want to share, it's a sketchy rumor at best. Um, we could see the return of, uh, Sophia accessories this year, right? Sophia is the black cat that's been around the Yankee Candle since they started doing Halloween, essentially. You know, she was always featured on the Happy Halloween Black Licorice Candle. Um, so we could be seeing some kind of accessories with her on it. Um, again, not confirmed, just a rumor at best. Okay, so in recapping, let me make sure I have all this stuff here. So we have the photos I put up there. Again, check my Instagram or check my YouTube community uh, feed. I'll post some stuff on there. Five fragrances, according to this, they list four, who knows, um, and that's going to be Witch's Brew, Haunted Hayride, Spider Cider, um, and Mystic Moon, and I believe the fifth one, if there is a fifth one this year, is going to be Jack-O-Lantern. Bony Bunch theme is Haunted Carnival, we just did that. Um, main accessory line is Phantasmagoria, uh, which is pretty neat. All Halloween candles on August 28th are $15. Don't know. That's large jars, by the way. Don't know if that's going to be an online deal or just an in-store deal. And the coupon here, this bounce back that you guys should be getting soon, is a buy one, get one free, all large jar candle and large tumbler from August 28th, which is, with, which is when Halloween launches through September 12th. So, um, and that's not... I don't believe it's valid on signature. I think it's just on the, it says all original large jar and large tumbler candles there. Though it does not specifically exclude signature. So, and that again is a in-store only promo. So, there you have it guys. Here's the official invitation, right, to the party. Um, I don't believe there is a Halloween catalog this year. Um, I know they had issues last year right where they put stuff in the catalog 
that wasn't actually ever produced, like the the witch, the cauldrons for Mystic Moon and Jack O' Lantern. So I think they're playing it safe this year. So um, we'll see. All right, guys, that's what I have for you for Halloween. If I get any more information in the coming weeks, um, I will be sure to share that. But this is just something to get you started, um, to think about, and um, get ready for. So, all right, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you all real soon. Stay safe out there.